Today we're gonna start with some deadlift, get the lower back in, get the power legs in. Then we're gonna start doing some upper back, you know what I mean? Probably gonna go to four or five, little three fifteen chicken nugget fifteen. What about you, Kevin? What you got to What? <laughs> Yeah, so we just started recording on our working set, which was about 315. So we would load up a play and every time we would load up a play, we would rep it out as much and then we would just load up another one. So yeah, um, yeah, we did some deadlifts. We went heavy on that. We maxed out at around 405. As you can see, I repped it out a couple times. And then we moved on to some bent over rows. And this is, we did the same thing on the platform with 145. So this is definitely gonna get you that wide back. This is gonna get you that nice thick back. It works out the outer lats. Um, you could definitely do different variations on the grip. You could do overhand, wide grip, underhand, low grip, all this different type of stuff does matter. It does target different portions of your back. And uh, if you're really about that shit and you wanna get the symmetry done, then that's important, to, uh, you know, position of your hands and um, pronation or sub supination. So yeah. So yeah, this is pretty much just a basic exercise. You pretty much just bend over and you uh, pull uh, the bar to your chest and give a big squeeze on the back. And then uh, that's just gonna get you the big old upper back and uh, get it nice and thick. And the next exercise is gonna be the lap pull down. Now this is obviously going to get the outer lats, which is going to get you that nice wide back. So pretty much if you're going to be doing any exercise that's pulling down towards or anything like that, it's pretty much going to work your outer lats and that's going to get you the nice wide back and any exercise that's going to be a pulling motion towards the body, such as a T-bar row, a bent over row, such as we just did that's gonna get you your back thickness, you know what I mean? So it's gonna be working your inner back, not your outer back, which is gonna get thickness. So lat pull downs wide, T-bar row thick. Yeah, just a quick little side note, but anyway, yeah, that's what we're doing right here. A quick little simple exercise on the machine. We're doing some lat pull downs, repping it out, getting me, getting Kevin, Kevin's getting me that, um, you know, <laughs> Kevin's getting me those nice back shots, you know what I mean? Cause uh, I'm actually very impressed with my uh, physique, even though I have been a little, you know, lazy with it and my physique can be a lot better. I know this, I know, I know, Kevin, you need to get on your shit, but my physique is gonna be coming in. It's gonna be crazy, um, but yeah. And the next exercise after that one is gonna be the lat pull in. Hold on, my bad. Let me check. I'm editing this too as I'm recording, so 
so that way I know what exercise I'm talking about. So yeah, this is called the lat pull-in. <laughs> Break the seat? <laughs> I think I you just broke the seat. I think you just broke the seat. It's about time. The thing is, the only ones who can break the seat are big guys. That's true. So we're just gonna call it the lap pull in and then this exercise is pretty much just gonna get you exactly what I was telling you about. It's gonna work the inner back to get you that nice thickness and yeah. Next is the T-bar row. Now, why is it called the T-bar row? Probably because as you can see, the bar looks like a T and you grab it and you pull it towards your chest as much as you can. You gotta pull it past your chest. That bar better hit your chest. Did I not mention that the bar is supposed to hit your chest? Anyway, so even though it's not hitting our chest in this video, just make sure it's hitting your chest. We pulling some heavy shit. This, this thing, Kevin pulled 315 T-bar row. I don't even, 315 pounds, bro, chill. I think I did like what 225, which is still pretty heavy, you know what I mean? But uh, I don't know. That's what you guys call a little T-bar row. That's gonna get you the nice thickness of the back. You're gonna get a retract the scapula. It's gonna get you that nice big wingspan. It's gonna even activate a little bit of the traps as well. So you're getting an all around bonus round here, baby. Let's get, yeah. Let's get back to it. Yeah. So yeah, this is the T-bar row. And like I said, this is just another pulling exercise that's gonna get you that nice inner back uh, uh, triangle, which is gonna get your back nice and thick. And like I said, different variations, wide grip, close grip, as you can see the machine has different variations. All of this targets different portions of your back. After that, it looks like we just did some other lap pull-in on a different machine though with different variations. It's got wide grip, close grip, underhand, overhand. So we just hit it a uh, different machine, but we just try to, you know, max out the back. And like I said, um, definitely keep in mind that the variations do matter. Um, such as like, you know, like I said, the back specifically has a lot of muscles in it. So it's gonna target different portions of, them, of the muscles. 
but yeah that's pretty much gonna wrap it up guys so uh make sure you guys like the video comment down what you guys think uh exercise you guys want to see all that fuck shit other than that i appreciate you guys for watching the video all right i'm gonna head out see you guys when i see you guys go get sexy baby